So I think um, one of my tips would be to make sure that we talk about all the good things that we've been doing. Um, we tend to have a habit of telling them about things that we're working on and maybe aren't quite right. Um, but I think it's really important that we also share all the good work we've done over the last two to three years. Um, because they'll want to hear that and they'll want to see that as well um, as part of their visit. We'll have a, a very positive impact and um, I think it's important as well that staff realise that we regularly meet with the CQC so we've been meeting with them every couple of months for the last two years so they are aware of things that have gone on in the organisation, things that we have changed. When they came the last time they thought we were doing quite a lot of different initiatives but they weren't always that coordinated. I think the QI and the collaborative and the adoption of a single methodology I think will really help support uh, their understanding that we are actually in much more organised now about how we do QI and how about we measure it, recognise it and celebrate the success. I think, you know, there's no point me saying don't, don't, don't worry because actually we all know we all have a level of anxiety and we're going to be worried about some aspect. Um, I think the thing to remember is that essentially they want to see the good work that we're doing uh, and they're coming in with that intention. Um, and all we've got to do is do the right thing and to do it well and show kindness to our service users and we will be okay. Um, I think what I'd like to say to them is be prepared. Uh, you know, know the key areas around your teams that maybe you've got risks or challenges in. Be able to articulate the great work that you do every day. Um, and wherever possible, just take a deep breath. You'll be okay. It will be fine.